When you're just starting out with SwiftUI, you get this code right here. And it's common to want to modify this VStack with a background color and expect it to fill the screen. For example, I might say dot padding, then dot background, dot red. As you can see, it does not happen. Instead, we get the same thing, but a little bit of red behind it and then a sea of white surrounding that. And this often confuses people. And it usually leads to the question, how do I make what's behind the view turn red or blue or whatever you want to do? Let me say this as clearly as I can. For Swift UI developers, there's nothing behind our view. You shouldn't try and make that white space turn red with weird hacks or weird workarounds, and you certainly shouldn't try and reach outside of Swift UI to do it. Now, right now, there's something behind the view. Technically, there is called a UI hosting controller, and that's the bridge between UI Kit, Apple's original UI framework, and Swift UI. However, if you start trying to modify that, you'll find your code no longer works in Apple's platforms, apart from iOS, for example, macOS or watchOS or visionOS. And in fact, it might stop working in iOS at some point in the future as well. Instead, you wanna try and get into the mindset that there's nothing behind our view, that what you see is all we have. And once you're in that mindset, I think the correct solution becomes clear. You simply wanna make this whole VStack here take up more space. You want to allow it to fill the whole screen rather than being precisely sized around its content. We can do that with the frame modifier, passing in infinity for both max width and max height. So we'd replace the padding modifier with this, dot frame, max width, dot infinity, max height, dot infinity. And now it correctly stretches to fill the screen. Now, we're using max width and max height here, not width infinity, height infinity. We're not saying the view must take up infinite space, that would be silly, only that it can grow to fill as much space as is available. This means if you have other views in the same layout, SwiftUI will make sure they all get enough space. 